Before the internet, DVDs and smartphones, there were arcade games, popular with kids in many parts of the world, including the former USSR. In Moscow, three friends have set up a museum where adults and children alike can enjoy some gaming, Soviet-style. They've now built up a collection of more than 150 machines. Co-founder Maxim says it's about fun and nothing more. With our museum, we're not making links with past periods. We don't want to be connected to politics or to talk about Soviet times. We don't have flags here. We don't have pioneers running around playing horns. We want to show the arcade machines the way they used to be. Most of the players are kids, but the interactive museum also attracts a lot of adults who want to be transported back in time. Somehow these Soviet things, these old five-kopec coins to operate the machines, it's just our childhood. Who knows, maybe in 30 years people will be going to museums to play with today's gadgets and games. The smartphone, a relic of a bygone era.